Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are at Rite Aid and we're here to do some deals for the week of the 3rd through the 9th of September. And originally my intro was done already by this time. It was done early in the morning, but um, I wanted to do a few more transactions for the video and I realized I messed my intro up pretty darn good. So I wanted to redo it for you guys. And then it's like, it looks like I'm doing couponing after dark like Jody does at Rite Aid. I promise that's not what I'm doing, but she's a force to be reckoned with in a very good way, very influential, influential, and I could totally see myself doing that. That usually at like eight o'clock at night, I am in my pajamas and I am watching Game of Thrones or Naked and Afraid or something like that. So anyways, Rite Aid is absolutely ridiculously on fire this week. Um, it might not seem like it, or last week, it definitely didn't seem like it. Um, I thought it was going to be slower this week, but we do have an in-ad booster of spend 50, get back $10 in bonus cash. And you can do that a limit of four times, uh, but you have to have all four barcodes. So I have heard that the social media barcode is the one giving people issues. So I don't have the new one if there is a new one that will work. So I'm just gonna be limiting myself to the three. Plus it's the beginning of the month and at the beginning of the month, I've heard, possibly heard that at the beginning of the month is when new threshold coupons are printing out, which I never called on to that, but it seems pretty, pretty consistent with that. And we started over with bonus cash challenges. And so I think it was Tuesday, we all got our bonus cash challenge money. So I, will not be paying for anything at all out of pocket. So I'm really, really excited about that. So anyways, long intro, let's go inside and see what we can do. So I'm gonna be working with a few different accounts today and a couple of different transactions on those accounts. So for the first transaction, we're going to be working an all digital deal on the PNG promotion. The PNG promotion is a limit of two and it is spend 30, get back $10 in bonus cash. The deals always track so you can split them up. So I'm going to grab these Tide Pods for $12.99 and I am going to also grab some Downy Beads, also priced at $12.99. Um, I have bonus cash challenges for Tide and Downy on this account, so that's awesome. Then I'm gonna grab some Mr. Clean, that is on sale for $3.99. And then I'm also going to grab uh, some Febreze, I think it's heavy duty, also on sale for $3.99. The total for all the products that I grabbed equals out to $33.96. So like I said, all digital for this one. So I have a $3 digital for the Tide Pods, $3 digital for the Downy Beads, a $2 digital for Mr. Clean, and a $2 digital for the Febreze. That will make my total $23.96, but then I'll get back $10 in bonus cash, making it $13.96 for all four products, which is an amazing deal but we're pairing it in with the spend 50, get back $10 in bonus cash booster as well. So we need to grab a few more things. And so we have a new battery deal this week. It is not a monthly deal. It is the same deal as last week, but it's a new deal. So it is a limit of two, so you can go ahead and max it out. I'm going to max it out as well. So here is a picture of the tag for the promotion. Like I said, it is a limit of two. And if you did it last week, you can do it again this week. So these are priced at $7.69. They're buy one, get one 50% off. I do have four batteries here and they are buy two, get back $10 in bonus cash. So the total for the four batteries will be $23.07. And then I'm going to get back $20 in bonus cash, making all four packs of batteries just $3.07. So I'm not at the total that I need to be at because I am using threshold coupons and digital coupons. I do need a few more dollars in my basket. So I'm gonna peruse around the store and see what I can find. And by that, I mean I go to the 75 cent percent off clearance section and I found this Asta Pro priced at $3.49. And there is a digital coupon, but I didn't test to see if it would give me any overage or not. And there's never a guarantee that digitals will come off of clearance items and give you overage. So I just didn't even mess with it. So anyways, that's $3.49. I did find a coupon reimbursement on the Shop Me on Map for $5 back. Plus I submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards. 
to get back another 4,000 points or $4, making that free and a $5.51 moneymaker. So that's everything that I'm grabbing in this transaction. My total is $60.52. I am using $10 in digital coupons and I have $50 in threshold coupons that I'm using. So I need to be at $60. So a quick word of advice that spend 50 get back $10 in bonus cash is not a threshold coupon. That is just a booster. The five off 25 coupons, those are threshold coupons. So the total for everything here is $60.52. I have $10 in digital coupons and then I'm going to use two five off 25 coupons. So that'll make my total $40.52. I'll get back $10 for my booster. $20 for my batteries and $10 for the PNG promotion. I'm also going to submit my receipt to Fetch Rewards for $4 back on the Astapro and Shop Meum for $5 back on the Astapro. Making everything in my cart free and an $8.48 moneymaker. Now let's go do another transaction. So this is on a different account and I'm at my old store and I love this store. We're going to do the PNG promotion again. We're going to max it out on this card. And like I said, it's spend 30, get back $10 in bonus cash. And I am going to grab a big guy here for $19.99 on sale. And another big guy of pods, also priced at $19.99. Then I am going to be grabbing some smaller tied liquids. I'm going to grab two of these for $12.99. You're welcome, Mom. I know it's your favorite. So anyways, so that does max out the deal. But I have a bonus cash challenge that I want to complete in this transaction. So I'm going to grab some of the Tides Simply. They're two for $7. I'm only grabbing one of them. So that one will ring up at $4.99. And I know what you're thinking, Sarah, why don't you grab the other one? So you're getting two for seven instead of one for five. And typically I would but I don't want to go that far over the amount that I need to be at because of a threshold coupon that I have. So I'm trying to keep it as cheap as possible. So my total for everything in the cart so far is $70.95. Just go with me here. I promise it's going to be good. Um, so I have a $4 digital coupon for the Big Tide Liquid. And then I'm going to be using some printable coupons from pggoodeveryday.com. I have a $4 printable for the Big Tide Pods and two $3 printables for the Tide Liquid. There is also a 50 cent digital for the Tide Simply on the app, but I'm trying to use as little digitals as possible on this transaction because I have a very large threshold coupon. So after my coupons, my total will equal out to $56.95. Now, with this transaction, just like it is, you can use those 5 off 25 coupons, and that'll make your total $46.95. But then you're going to get back $20 in bonus cash for doing the PNG deal twice, plus using that in ad booster, you would get another $10 back. I'm also going to get back $17 from a bonus cash challenge because I have a huge one where you spend $68 in Tide products, you get back $17. That's going to make everything in this cart free in a five cent money maker, which is absolutely amazing. Amazing. But I'm going to throw something else in there and use a very large threshold coupon. So we're going to go grab the Colgate Pro Series. It's on sale for $9.99 this week. I want you to look at this tag. This is a weekly deal, but it's a limit of four. And it's buy one, get back $5 in bonus cash. So this is going to be $9.99. We have a $5 digital coupon. We'll pay $4.99, but then we'll get back $5 in bonus cash, making this free. So if you're brand new to Rite Aid or you want to start couponing at Rite Aid, this is the perfect beginner-friendly deal because this is going to end up being free. It's a low out-of-pocket. It's a digital deal, and it's a great way to get started. So we're just going to do it one time on this account. So this is everything that I'm grabbing for my second transaction. The total for everything in the cart equals out to $80.94. Now in my first transaction, I got a threshold coupon of 18 off of 70. That's why I'm spending so much in this transaction. 
So since my threshold is $70 and I have $9 in digital coupons, I need to spend $79. And since I wanted to hit that threshold for the bonus cash challenge, I'm totally fine with this transaction. So like I said, my total is $80.94. After that $18 threshold coupon, my total is $62.94. After all of my other coupons, my total will then be $43.94. So I am going to pay that total with all bonus cash. I'm not going to pay anything out of pocket. But then I am going to get back $20 for doing the PNG deal twice. I'm going to get back $10 for doing the spend 50, get back $10 in bonus cash. And I'm also going to get back $5 in bonus cash for doing the Colgate deal. Then I'm going to also get back $17 in bonus cash for spending $68 in Tide products. So then that's going to make my total for everything free and an $8.06 moneymaker. And that is absolutely insane to me for getting these huge Tide products, especially the big, big ones, for free and a moneymaker. So we're going to go back to the first account that we used today and we're going to max out the PNG promotion, but we're going to combine that with the PNG rebate that is also spend 30 get back a $10 Visa card. Now with this rebate, you have to focus on getting everything in one transaction. You need to either pick Tide or Gain products and you have to have a laundry product and a fabric softener product. So I grabbed a Tide Pod and a Tide Liquid and a Downy Scent Beads, all priced at $12.99. So that'll equal out to $38.97. I left my coupons in the car, so I'll have to run out and get them. But I have a $3 printable for the pods and a $3 printable for the liquids, and I don't have anything for the Downy. That'll make my total $32.97, but then I'll get back $10 in bonus cash for maxing out the PNG promotion and a $10 Visa card from the pggoodeveryday.com website. That's going to make everything here just $12.97, so it's like buying one and getting two for free. But, of course, we're going to combine it with the in-ad booster. Now, I will be using a threshold coupon, so I will want to grab other items in this transaction, and I'll want to make sure the cashier scans them first so that the threshold coupon attaches to those items and not my P&G items. So when you're submitting a P&G rebate, they look at the product and then the coupon attaching to the product. So you want your $3 coupons to look like they're attaching to the right products. So then we're going to move on to some Arm & Hammer items. So Arm & Hammer is buy one, get one free, and it's spend 15, get back $5 in bonus cash. So I'm gonna grab two of these spin brushes, and then I found more hanging on the aisle, so I grabbed two more, and they're $9.99 a piece. So of course, the free items that you grab do not count towards that $15. So then I'm also going to be grabbing some Arm & Hammer toothpaste. I'm going to grab four of them. They're priced at $5.49 a piece, and they're also buy one, get one free. So between the toothpaste and the spin brushes, I would be at $30.96. But then I decided that I was going to be way over the mark that I needed to be to use my threshold coupon. So I decided to take out the spin brushes and do them on a separate transaction and just grab the toothpaste. So four of these toothpaste will equal out to $10.98. I won't get back any bonus cash until the next transaction because I'm not spending $15 worth, but I have a dollar digital coupon. There's also a dollar on Shopmium, which I didn't know about until after I did my math. So then my total would be $9.98, and I would submit my receipt to Ibotta and get back a dollar on each one of them, even the free ones. So then that would make my total um, $5.98, which doesn't seem great, but then you can figure in the spin brushes later, and it's a much better deal. So then when I went and grabbed my coupons, I realized I had to switch up my items. So I grabbed a Tide Pods instead of a Tide Liquid. And here are my printables that I will be using. I'm also $1.05 short, so I'm going to throw in this water. 
So the water costs $1.59 and that makes my total for everything $51.54. I have a threshold coupon of $13 off of $50 plus my dollar digital coupon and my $3 printable coupons. That makes my total $31.54. I'll get back $10 for the spend 50 get back 10 booster i'll get back ten dollars for the png promotion and then i'll also get back ten dollars in that png visa card that makes everything in the cart free and a two dollar and 46 cent money maker which is great anything that's free and a money maker is amazing so we're going to start our last transaction and we're going to finish off the arm and hammer promotion that is spend 15 get back five dollars in bonus cash it's buy one get one free it is a limit of two so i have four spin brushes here if you can't tell that equals out to 19.98 i don't have any coupons for these so then that would be 19.98 but then i'll get back ten dollars in bonus cash for maxing out the arm and hammer deal and then i'm going to get back eight dollars in a bonus cash challenge for spending 31 dollars in um, Arm and Hammer products. So that's going to make all four of them just $1.98, which I think is an amazing deal. So next we're going to go back to the Colgate. We're going to grab two of them because it is a limit of four, and these are $9.99 a piece. And we have a $5 digital coupon on this account that we can use, and we're going to submit our receipt to Shopmium for the other $5 back. So then we will be paying $9.98 and we will get back $10 in bonus cash, making them free. So we are almost to the $50 mark and we need to be at $55 so we can use our five off the 25s and our digital coupon. So the store has two of the Cottonelle left. The Cottonelle, the six pack is on sale for $6.99 and they are a buy two get back two dollars in bonus cash which isn't great but it's still going to be a really great deal then we're going to grab the icy hot that is in the clearance section these are priced at 4.49 which are 75 percent off and we have a two dollar rebate on ibotta making it 2.49 so that's everything for our last transaction here is everything that we got i know it's not very presentable but our total will equal out to $58.43. And then we're going to be using two of those 5 off 25 coupons. We have a $5 digital coupon that we are going to use as well. That makes my total $38.43. I'll get back $32 in bonus cash, 10 for the booster, 10 for the Arm & Hammer, and 10 for the Colgate plus $2 for the Cottonelle. I'll also get back $8 and a bonus cash challenge for that Arm & Hammer. I'll submit my receipt to Shopmium for the other $5 back on the other Colgate and $2 on Ibotta for the Icy Hot. That makes everything free in this transaction plus a $6.57 money maker, which is crazy considering the Cottonelle is not really that good of a deal. All right, let's go check out Let's go out to the car and take a look at the receipts and see how everything went. All right guys, so we're back in from Rite Aid and typically I would wait until the morning to film this part uh, just because it's late and it's getting dark, but I really was excited about my totals and I just wanted to film it. So, one thing I wanna say is that there was not one issue there was not one single issue, number one. Number two, I spent no money out of my own pocket. No money out of my own pocket. Unbelievable. So, let's go over the transactions. We got four transactions, and I just can't wait. So, so the first transaction I did, thank you, motorcycle. The first transaction I did was on the... Uh, PNG deal, which I mainly did the PNG deal, but my first transaction was on the PNG deal with just one Tide, one Downy, a Febreze, and a Mr. Clean. I also got batteries and that Asta Pro. On that transaction, I used all digital coupons. So I had a $3 digital coupon for the Tide, a $3 digital for the Downy, a $2 digital for the Febreze, and a $2 digital for the Mr. Clean. All of those come off. I also used the five off 25 coupons one of them says it's expired it doesn't say it's expired we thought it was going to expire 
and then the other one it doesn't expire until October and those are in my community tab so I used those as well so then that brought my total to forty dollars and fifty two cents I got back forty dollars in bonus cash I got back ten for the booster ten for the spend twenty get or spend thirty get ten and then I got twenty for the batteries I also submitted my receipt to a Shopmium for $5 back for a coupon reimbursement for the Astapro. I got back $4 on Fetch for the Astapro. And I also got back 605 points, which equals out to $1.21. That makes that transaction free and a $9.69 money maker, which is incredible. Incredible for an all digital deal. I like to configure my points that way so that I can just see exactly what I got because I know like um, coupon mode does it, Jody does it, and I'm sure there's some other people that do it as well. They just say when they get over a thousand points, you know, go from 1,000 points to like, you know, if they have 1,700 points and then they get 2,100 points, they just add $2 to their total. I tried doing that and I was getting confused. I like this way better. So anyways, the next transaction I did was all that tied, just tied, just swimming in tied. So anyways, for this transaction, I got a big tied liquid, a big tied pods. Um, then I got two tied liquids for $12.99. I got a Tide Simply, and then I got a Colgate. So for this transaction, I wanted to use printable coupons. I did not want to use digitals because I had that high threshold, but I did use some digitals. So I had a $4 load to card coupon for the Tide Liquid. I had a $4 coupon for the Tide Pods. I had a $3 coupon for the Tide Liquid and another $3 coupon for the Tide Liquid. Then I had a $5 load to card coupon for the Colgate Pro Series. And then I had that $18 off of 70 coupon. And here it is guys, $18 come off totally fine. So then that brought my total down to $43.94. I got back $35 in bonus cash. I got back $10 for the booster. I got back $5 for the Colgate and $20 for the Tide. Then I'll get back $17 from a bonus cash challenge for the Tide. And then I got back 808 points, or 809 points, excuse me. And that equals out to $1.62, making that transaction free and a $9.68 money maker. So that's great. So on the first transaction, I got that 18 off of 70. On this transaction, I got a 13 off of 50. And so then I use that on my next transaction. So on my third transaction, I wanted to do the gift card deal through P&G. So I did the Tide and then the Tide and the Downy. And then I got the Arm & Hammer. Um, I got the Arm & Hammer toothpaste and then I got a water. So I had a $3 printable coupon for the Tide pods, another $3 printable coupon for the Tide pods, and a dollar low to card coupon for the Arm & Hammer toothpaste. And then I had a 13 off of 50 coupon come off. I like to show you guys those on the receipts because those are big coupons. I'm sure people are watching me, but whatever. So then that brought my total down to $31.54. I got back $20 in bonus cash. I got back 10 for the spend 30 at 10 and then 10 for the booster. So then I'll get back $10 from that PNG promotion on a gift card. I got back $4 on Ibotta for the Arm & Hammer toothpaste. And it did give me credit for all four of them, even though two of them were free. And then I got back 515 points, which is a dollar three, making that transaction free and a three dollar and forty nine cent money maker, which I'm very very pleased with. It. So then on that transaction, I was like, okay, if I get a printout and it's not a super big one, I will use it. I did get one. I did get a Catalina, but it was another 18 off of 70. I will save that because later on in the month we have a spend 50 get back 15. So I'm gonna save that for then, which getting up to $70 or $80 really isn't that hard. So then we have one more transaction. So this one, this one I got the Arm & Hammer spin brushes. I got two of the Colgate. I got uh, two of the Cottonelle and then I got the Icy Hot. So my total for that transaction was $38.43. I got back $32 in bonus cash. 
Sorry, there's a sign right there and I keep thinking it's somebody. So I got back $5 for each one of the Colgates. I got back $2 for the Cottonelle. I got back $10 for the Booster. And then I got back $10 for completing the Arm & Hammer deal twice. So that is a limit of two. Then I'll get back $8 from a bonus cash challenge for the Arm & Hammer. I'll get back $5 on Shop Ma'am for that other Colgate and $2 on Ibotta for the Icy Hot. I also submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards just to see if I'd get anything for the Cottonelle. I got back $0.34 cents from Fetch and then I had 584 points. So that equals out to $1.17. So that makes that transaction free in a $10.08 money maker. So what does that make all of my transactions? That makes all of my transactions today free in a $32.94 money maker. Holy moly, guys. That is in, that's just incredible. That is just absolutely incredible that I could do that with no money. Well, no money spent, not with no money. You know what I mean? Because I had my bonus cash challenge money hit and it was insane. Absolutely insane. And um, definitely, if you haven't done any transactions, go up there, get a water, get a pop, get a candy, and see if you'll get any threshold coupons like I did. Also, I want to make a mention of my printable coupons. I got my printable coupons from pggoodeveryday.com, which most of us know that. That is linked down below if you uh, haven't been printing from there yet. I printed once from my phone and once from my computer, and that's how I was able to do it twice. So that's why I had two of every coupon. So anyways, guys, that is all I have for you today. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you guys have a great day. And let me know what you're getting at Rite Aid this week, and I will see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.